there's nobody on overtime, there's nobody working on the weekends. There's a lot that could be done to have this done a lot sooner. And I'm here every day. <clears throat> well, she lives on the first floor, and you, so I mean, I don't see. I care about my other neighbors. Well, I mean, so I mean, the pe the, the it, it was it's scheduled. It's a contracted job. Um, we don't tell the elevator company when when to work their people. They submit a, a schedule to us. They said they could do the elevator in six weeks. Okay. So all we're all all we're trying to hold them to to is is meeting their deadline. Um, as far as working, doing elevator repairs six, seven, eight o'clock at night, I don't see that as being a typical process. Nor do I is it a typical process to be working on. We've got to go now. I want to okay. thank you both. Thank, thank you. you. All right, it's back to you, Jim. Ali, uh, don't let her go away. This that, that, that's uh, what does she have a response to that? Is she still there? What's that? Did, did the lady just leave? Yeah. Oh, that's too bad. We should we should have kept uh, that discussion. She's going. back if you want her. Yes. She heard you. Yes. What would you like to know? I would like to know a response to what the gentleman said. The gentleman's a very effective spokesperson for the for the company, but uh, obviously the people who live there are not satisfied with his explanation. Right. So what do you want now? Well, if I have to teach you how to be a reporter, Ali, I'll do that later. Oh, why don't you do that later, Jim? Uh, I think the lady expressed herself, and uh, you're not here, you're there. Would, is there any question you'd like me to ask her? Uh, no, I, I, I'll, I'll give you lessons on how to become a reporter later well, I'll on. give you some lessons on how to be an editor, because I was your boss once. Yeah, you were, and are no longer. How did that happen? Uh, well, I don't Here's know. Here's Ernabel DeMillo. Hey, good morning, Jim. We are live 